Aaron, you bet your ass we're saving the best for last. I wonder why I got my Telly Savalas and my Lazenby up? It's because we're trying some Beluga Hybrid Caviar. Mmm, mmm. Why didn't I put this in the Twinkies? Hello, you're giving it a slightly more distinctive taste. Now, I, to my knowledge, haven't actually had caviar before. Uh, so why not? Let's make this an episode of the show. Uh, no reason I particularly haven't. It's just I've never been somewhere where it's been offered. Um, if I did have it, I wasn't aware of that sort of, if it was an ingredient or if it was like a topping on a piece of sushi or something. I wasn't aware of it, really. Um, my experience with caviar is watching George Lazenby put the biggest spoonful of cavi caviar on the cracker in Her Majesty's Secret Service, and Tom Hanks not liking it very much in Big. So, what reaction am I going to have? Oh, look, at there it is. Mmm, mmm, mmm. Looks like something I would have dug out of the bird's nest drink. That smells like... <laughs> That smells like water that fish live inside of. Mmm. 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 -hmm. Ah, uh, hoo hoo. This didn't cost very much, so that's funny. So I, I basically got this for about a hundred bucks. So if if you want, um, if you have thousand dollar taste on a Budweiser budget, just head yourself over to Ulma Foods. That's where I ordered this from. All right, let me get my Trisket out. Put this on a little Trisket. Let's uh, scoop some of this caviar on the end here or right in the middle whatever now if you're gonna leave me a message that or a comment or something that says something along the lines of uh, Trisket what or that portions too big or that portion is too small you're really under the impression that I care so all right there's there is mm, bon appetit It goes back and forth between salty, um, a little buttery, and then just straight up like eating raw a raw fish that I just dug out of the lake. It's not a heavy taste, uh, so like the raw fishy taste kind of comes and goes. The taste of the lake. Um, yeah. Hmm. Yeah, we just try it on its own. Mmm, mmm, mmm. I dug up the balls from the old Orbitz drink. That's rubbery. That is so rubbery. Mmm. -mm. Ah. Ah. I feel like I'm eating a terrible porn. Mm. When the ball breaks open, it's so salty. <laughs> Don't you hate it when that happens? Huh. Hmm. Yeah, that's interesting. Oh, God. I don't know how Lazenby did that entire bite. Um, I don't have as bad of a reaction as, like, Tom Hanks did in Big. It doesn't make me want to spit it out and gasp and just wipe a napkin over my throat or anything like that. It just, um... Maybe if it was mixed with some delicious shredded cheese and ranch dressing. Or if it was on like a spider roll or something. Why do I keep doing that? It keeps getting saltier. Mm. Too salty. Too salty. And too fishy. It's very fishy. Um, remember the episode of New Girl where they were spending Thanksgiving in the woods and Nick Miller wanted him to capture like their own food and then he found a dead fish laying around in the lake and he put it on the end of the stick and he was gonna roast that over the fire and then the eyeball popped out of it 
it tastes, I, I'll bet you that is, that tastes kind of like this. At least maybe the eyeball that popped out of it. <laughs> um, it was actually really kind of annoying ordering this because this was a website that you got to pick what day he wanted it delivered to you. So, mm -mm. I picked a couple weeks in advance and then a couple weeks went by and I didn't get it. And so I was like, all right, our mail system kind of sucks around Springfield. So maybe it'll be here in a few days. Like a week went by and I still didn't get it. Um, so I wrote to the company and was like, yeah, I paid like extra shipping for it to be delivered on this particular date and it hasn't come yet. What the fuck? I didn't say what the fuck, but I was thinking it. They wrote back and were like, Oh yeah, we couldn't deliver it on that particular. We couldn't get it ready and deliver it on that particular date, so we weren't sure if you still wanted it. In my head, I'm like, you know what would have solved that question? Writing to me and asking me. So I was like, I wrote back and was like, yeah, I, I, I still want it. They're like, okay, we'll get it shipped. So it came in like a week or something like it. It took about a week. And um, no, I didn't get a refund on the extra shipping that I paid in order to get it to the original date. Was it worth all of that? No. <laughs> but I'm sure I maybe got some funny reactions of putting the eggs in my mouth. <laughs> so maybe it was worth it. I don't know. Um, I'm going to pay close attention to my stomach tonight that has a mixture of Twinkies, Triscuits, Caviar, 7-Up, and energy drink in my stomach. That's nice. I'm just going to lay on the couch for a while. Bye!